Hi, I'm Doug, your tech support representative for Atlantic British, and in this video we're going to be covering the air filter replacement for your D90 as part of our service and maintenance kits. Now, this particular kit that you would be ordering for your D90 is going to be filter element kit RTC4683. As you can see by the charts, recommended every 30,000 miles. So with this kit, you'll be receiving this air filter, and then we're going to show you how to install the air filter yourself. It's a very relatively easy job, only takes a few minutes. Okay, so now we're going to show you how to install an air filter element into the D97 D90. Now this is going to be the filter you receive, and this is kit number RTC4683. Nothing more than a paper element, rubber seal on both sides. And again, this is recommended to be done every 30,000 miles. If you do more off-roading and in dusty areas, you probably want to do it less in uh, 15,000, 20,000. Air filter is critical as far as engine reliability and fuel economy. So, what we're going to do is set the box aside. Again, I always recommend if you're working over the fenders, especially on a D90 with the aluminum fenders, you want to drape a nice fender cover over the top. This is one of our Atlantic British foam fender covers. You're going to reach in and you have three clips that hold this intake housing on. Now the one in the back is a little on the tight side and you can usually clip it out. Once you get the top two out you can sometimes flip these out without having any problems. Inside, looks like we have an 11 millimeter nut. Now this is a nylon locking nut so that the filter doesn't uh, slide out from there. Okay, so the nut that retains that is going to be, you can use either a 7 16 or an 11 millimeter socket depending on what you have in your toolbox. We're going to run that nut off. It's going to be a little tight because it's designed to be that way so it doesn't back off on its own. Once you feel the nut loosen up, reach in and put your hand underneath it because you don't want to drop it out of the socket and falling down back and behind the engine. Could end up spending more time chasing that nut down than changing the filter. Set your tool down. As a recommendation, do not set any tools down on the top of the defender fenders. These aluminum fenders, you put a little bit of weight on them and it will actually leave an impression in them. That's why the fender cover, that's why you never lay your tools down on top of them. Reach in, pop out the cover, pull your heater hoses up out of the way, don't worry about bending it a little bit, you're not going to reuse it anyway. And that's a reasonably dirty filter. Uh, in most cases you see one like this, you probably want to change it. You can see where you've got enough buildup on the paper where it's going to restrict air intake. Just take that, we'll discard that one. One hand back, hold your hoses. Doesn't matter which way you install it, the gasket's the same on both sides. Slide in all the way until you feel its seat. Reinstall your cap. And you should feel it, it'll seat right up against that rubber gasket. Reinstall your nut. Now you don't need to make the nut super tight, you just want it good and snug. Too tight and you could end up doing some damage to the air filter. Just snug in there and then just make sure that you're tight up against the filter so we have a good tight seal. Now the snorkel or the intake, there's no indentations, there's no anything there that's going to make this a, a, a one-shot installation. In other words, it, doesn't, it isn't indexed. So we can just basically put it on, slide that on there. Slip the top two on because they're easiest to get at. And then reach underneath, pull the clip forward, 
and the snap back and we have all three on there nice and tight so now you have a good air filter on there and as I said it's recommended every 30,000 miles you should change that filter again you go off-road or you're in a dusty area maybe once every 20,000 but it's a good idea to check it actually every other oil change so that's an air filter installation on a D90. This is with the 4.0 engine. And uh, again, you can call any of our knowledgeable salesmen. They'll be happy to help you out at 1-800-533-2210.